All right, so now we're gonna talk about the saddle double trouble situation once again, and we're gonna talk about a Texas clover leaf or a sideways knee bar, okay? So the Texas clover leaf, when I learned it, it was mostly a pain compliance move here where I would kind of get this grip here. I bring my left arm around his inside leg. I gable grip my hands and I pull across here, okay? This is very uncomfortable for Tyler, but if we're in a fight and there's you know money on the line, he's probably not gonna tap, okay? So what I'm gonna do instead, I'm gonna turn my hips in like this, okay? So now I'm using my hips, similar to a heel hook, but I've got this Texas cloverleaf grip, okay? So now I can hip in, pull back, and I can get an attack on the knee as well as this ankle paint here, right? So we're in the cloverleaf here like this. I wrap my arms here. If I just pull back like this and kind of rip it, it's gonna hurt, but he's probably not gonna tap, okay? When I turn my hips here, and my hips are driving against his knee and I'm pulling like this, that's gonna be kind of a sideways knee bar attack. This is also gonna open up heel hook attacks, right? If he tries to pull his leg out to escape, then I can go back to my heel hook here that we just talked about, all right? So that is the Texas Clover, Texas, Texas Cloverleaf sideways knee bar from the saddle double trouble position.